Hey guys, uh, Leif here from uh, ATEC Office Technology. Today I'm going to show you how user authentication works on the uh, Comic and Alta Blizzard series. So uh, if you have a look uh, at the screen now, uh, I've actually just uh, configured user authentication on here. And I'm going to show you how this works and how you uh, operate it. So on the screen here, the first thing you see is the authentication screen. So we have to log in in order to use the machine. So the first thing you notice here, and this is optional, there's a public user access account. So I could just click on there at the moment and that would log me straight in. This is an optional uh, setting that you can enable public user authentication or not. And obviously it sort of defeats the purpose a bit because we can log in as the public user without using a, a password or authenticate ourselves. Having said that, this public user could have rights to, for example, only do uh, black and white copying, but uh, restricted color use, for example. Uh, when we want to log out, we hit this access button. So I'll just press that. And now I'm logged out as the public user. Uh, the other way to log in, you can see over the left here, we've got authentication device or ID and password. I'm just going to change this one to ID and password at the moment because that's the next uh, option for logging in. So we need a username and password to log in. I can click on this button on the right hand side here with that list symbol. Uh, that's an option as well to show that list or not. I'm just going to select my login which is uh, life. So I'm going to say OK to that. Then I'm going to put in my password. In this case, I've got one, two, three, four is my password and OK and log in. So that's it. That's how you log in with a username password. Uh, I'm now going to log out again just to show you the third option of logging in. And that would be, you can see it's highlighted on there with authentication device. So that would be to have some kind of smart card or a, uh, or a sensor to log in. So with this option, I'm just, this is one of the uh, uh, proximity cards. So there's actually a sensor sitting behind there. there. So you just uh, pass that near the sensor and we're now logged in. You could also keep this card in your wallet. Uh, as long as you place your wallet on there, it'll uh, log you in. And we can hit this access button again to log out. And uh, that's how we authenticate uh, users. So uh, you can also watch my next video on how to set up user authentication. And um, there should be a link below and just click on that. Thanks for watching.